Now take a listen to this sound, it's a steel guitar sound. So what's happening there? Well, I'm using what's known as a velocity split to switch between two separate tones. So let's go into patch common velocity range and have a look at the display. Well, it shows us here that tones one, three, and four are active. Tones one and three are simply left and right parts of a stereo guitar sound. And you can see here shown a black line for each of those tones and a velocity range, an active range, if you like, of velocities 1 to 115 on each of those tones. That means if I play the key with velocity strength between 1 and 115, I will hear those tones. However, down here, tone 4 is the sound of the harmonic, and this tone will be active from velocity 116 to 127. So I'm only going to hear that if I play really hard. And you can see the line up here demonstrates this effect. Okay, so it's active for a very, very small range of the top of the velocity range. So that's how you can split the patch according to velocity.